Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Pope Joe Fitz plays Fallout 4. In the last part we freed these guys from uh, like a like they were being held captive by a bunch of raiders and yeah basically we came in, killed everybody and they took the, the credit. So fuck them. But uh yeah, so in the in the gap between the episodes I literally just walked them back here to Sanctuary and now I just have to go and talk to Preston Garvey. Hey. I'm glad you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? Um, well, yeah, I kind of used to live here. Yeah, I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... Yeah, I'm, I'm like, like 200 years old. Or a bit more, actually, because there's a bit more than 200 years, and then, like... I was already like 30 something. I lived here over 200 years ago. I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? Well, I don't, I don't really want to talk about it. No. It's, I don't want to talk about yeah. it. Yeah. No worries. We've all got our past to deal with. Yeah, it's, it's quite personal. I don't, I don't want to share with this chap that I just met. Anyway, I am glad you're here. And I hope you don't Awkward mind. Stare. But I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. They're still hoping there are Minutemen out there somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out the settlement? Yeah, sure, why not? I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. The men and men could use more people like you. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. Sturgis! Call Will too. Yo, Sturgis, I'm here. You asked for help. What kind of help do you need? Yeah, uh, yeah, just ask that. <laughs> what kind of help do you need? Well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground for too long. Yeah, sure. Why not? Glad to help. Okay, good deal. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof over our heads. Some of these old houses still look solid enough to do the trick. There's a workbench over there you can use. Give me a holler if you need anything. Okay, yeah, so these missions with Sturges are just tutorializing you on uh, on how to build stuff. So basically, you have to go around, just, yeah, get into the workbench. Yeah, this is just showing you how to do the workbench. But uh, yeah, you have to go around and scrap everything that you see. Like, literally everything, just to get building materials. This is a bit... The building in this is just basically Minecraft, but like it actually looks good. So chop down a bunch of trees and street lamps and take down some cars. I think I'm gonna build like like flats over here, like a big like apartment complex, but less of an apartment, more of a more of a tenement building. Basically, just like a bunch of fucking beds just piled into a room in any way, shape, or form that I can. But yeah, I'm gonna have to cut out a lot of me just going around talking. Or just go around scrapping. I think just for now, I'm just gonna just do what he needs me to do in these missions. I think I'm just gonna do what he wants me to do in these missions and then leave it for a little while. I will be doing quite a bit of building in this playthrough, but uh, just not right now. I wanna like, I wanna, I'll, I'll scrap like everything here outside of a video. It's just right now that I'm actually recording. I might just do what needs to be done and then come back to it later when I want to start doing stuff creatively. But like, yeah, this. Just, just um, going around scrapping everything is a load of fat. Building's quite entertaining though, so I'll, I'll make videos about just building, but scrapping, not so much. Who does a chemistry stand here? I don't remember. Well, I do remember it, but like I forgot about it until now. Here is where I usually build like a power station. The fuck was that? I don't have any bullets for that gun. The fuck was that? Bad roach. Kill the cunt. Ooh, shot his left leg off. Uh, is there any more? I think that was the lot of them. You showed up a bit late, didn't you? Just go around scrapping. I should have a, like a sing-along when I'm going around scrapping. Is that a good idea? 
I, I might put a card in, above me, or a card in the top right corner to see if people want to see me sing on uh, these videos when I'm just going around scrapping. I'll just pick like a Disney song or something and sing all the way through it. I will collect the data from that poll and then continue and then do whatever that poll tells me to do because I am now your slave. I do what you will me to do. That's what YouTubers do, right? That's how you get big. You just like bend to your audience. You don't have any integrity or spine. I always find like scrapping around here kind of morbid because you're literally just destroying everything that your that your neighbors held dear to them with no remorse whatsoever. Get the fuck off that chair, I need it. Uh, you, is that a fucking mine? Well, it's mine now. Is that, a, is that a working terminal? Oh my god. <laughs> it's a functioning terminal. I'm just gonna try hack this bad boy. One likeness. Uh, D-A-M-N. No. D-A-M-N. It could be that. One likeness. There's only one likeness between us. So uh, the second letter is an A, so could it be cage? It's two likenesses. Okay. It's cash. It has to be cash. It's not cash. And I got locked out. Balls! Right, then start going around scrapping again. Because <laughs> I'm not arse waiting for that. I never realised there was a functioning terminal there. Maybe that was just added in a DLC, or maybe it's in one of my mods or something. Did I put mods in the description of my last video? I actually cannot remember for the life of me. Did I not move that? Oh no, I, I, I was in the middle of moving that and then I got attacked by a rad rush. That's what happened. Uh, right, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna stick this... This is gonna be my cookhouse. This this blue house here. This is gonna be my cookhouse. It's both for cooking food and meth. So, um... <laughs> that's the best kind of cookhouse. If you go to like an outback steakhouse and they ask you do you want meth, say yes. I'm a bad influence. <laughs> okay, I think I have scrapped enough around the the settlement for now just to get whatever he just wanted He just wanted some um beds, didn't he? Okay, so I'm gonna set set up here somewhere. Right, you there, and then there, and then there, and then there. Yeah. What always annoys me is, like, these things don't, like, click to the edges of these, so if you want to use the bases of the house as a base of a house, it's basically impossible to get it to not be, like... Actually, that's not too bad, but, like, it's still quite annoying uh, that, like, it doesn't line up, and that annoys me a great, 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 great deal. But we will continue. Let's keep building. Let's keep building. Yeah, see, and it, they don't, they don't fucking match up. This is basic game design. <laughs> Just let me like build what I want to build. It's not that difficult. But yeah, it's it's I, I still like the building. I'm I'm not complaining. Well I am complaining, but it's not too bad of a complaint. And now the walls of the house. The wall goes up there, there. This is just the beginning of this building. This this is going to be a massive skyscraper eventually. Hopefully. Hopefully we'll get that far. Keep building, yep. Now you now you, and we're going to use this here, yes, and yeah, that'll do for now, that's just the walls, and I just stick a roof on it, just a basic flat roof, uh, just all around, because I literally just want to put in like five beds, and then just get on to the next part of this tutorial. Uh, I just I just want to blaze through this tutorial. Eventually, I will get round to like doing a lot more uh, building. Like we're probably going to have entire episodes dedicated to building. Right now, I need to go find beds. Where are they? They're in furniture, I believe. Yes, beds. And um, I'm I've got the DLC, so I'm going to actually build the clean beds to come with the the vault building. <laughs> so this is actually going to be like the nicest place in the entire Commonwealth. Right, and two beds, I think we only, what do we need, five, three beds, four beds, and five beds, I'll stick, I'll stick a couple more beds, because we're probably going to have more people just jaunting along, coming around for the, for the, for, well we definitely will, because I sent my, all my companions here, so we're just going to stick down a few more beds. Uh, I think that should be enough right there. 
And I'm going to do what I always do and give them all like little like foot lockers at the end of their beds. Because I'm a nice person. I, I, I treat my guys right. Is that a big enough foot locker to want? Yeah, I'll give them this, the metal box. Um, what way around does that go? I think the hinge is... Yeah, I think that's that's the right way. Okay, right. Uh, you go there. Yep, yeah. and then you there. And then budge over. You there. You there. You there. You... There and you there and I've got one more to put down. And you there. There we go. That's enough. That's 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 housing for everybody. Right, what do you want now? Oh Sturgis. Sturgis. I like it. Having a place to sleep will improve everyone's spirits. What we need now is a reliable source of clean water. Uh yeah, so let's, let's, let's get clean going on that. Up. Great. Thanks again. Right. Now we need to make a water pur 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 Now we need to make a water purifier. I definitely didn't. Yeah, please ignore the fact that I can't talk. And I need to, where where it's resources, isn't it? Yeah, water over here. Uh, I always I always is this a water pump? Can I just like stick this anywhere? Oh yeah, this is a little water pump. It must have been a, yeah, it's part of the DLCs. Yeah, I can build two of them. I need a rank of science to do that, so I can't do that right now. Uh, I'm going to build one of these bad boys in the river over here because they it brings in more water so it's I just have to build literally this and then power it and uh, now I need to go over to power generators uh, I think I'll, I'll just for now uh, yeah just just like go over here this generator is gonna be just like out in the middle of nowhere for now. This is literally just a so. Oh god, I have to put a fucking connector in. Yeah, so into you connectors. I put a tall pylon in between them. And another one there. Okay, yeah. So I'm going to connect this to this, this to this, and then this to this, and that should be enough water. Yep, that's grand. Now just go over and talk to Sturges again. Oh no, he's going to be in bed, so I'm going to have to wake him up. Now I feel like a dick. Uh, which bed is Sturgis in? That's... No, no. There's Sturgis. Sturgis, wake the hey, fuck Sturgis. up. Wake the fuck up. Get up. Come on. I feel better already. Knowing we have a reliable supply of clean water. I what do you want next? I hope you don't mind me asking for some more help. But our food supplies are running low. If we're going to settle here... We'll need to get some crops established. Yeah, just yeah, I'll just start planting right away. I just have to do fucking everything, I suppose. Fucking useless bastard. Right, so basically, to get food supplies, you need to harvest food and then plant the seeds. So come over here. There's always food behind here in be sanctuary. Well. Uh, there's some gourd or something over here, and that is it. So, yeah, so now I go into the workshop, hold M V, and then go over to resources again, and into food this time. And I can plant, what can I plant? I can plant, I can plant one gourd. There. And then I can plant a couple of melons. I didn't pick up any mute fruit on my travels, did I? No, 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 no. Okay, that's all the food that I can place down right now. And it's only 60% done, so I actually have to wait. Which is kind of poo. Can, can I find any more? This is quite annoying. Maybe I'll just... I'm just going to sleep in one of the beds for a couple of hours and then wake up and hopefully the plants will grow because that's how video games work. Just realised, never put a door on this thing. I'll stick a door on it now. Um, yeah. So just over to... Where, where it would it be? In, I assume it would just be in wood, wouldn't it? Uh, no, it's not there. There's doors. Just just stick a basic door there. Get out of here. Open the door into my face and close it behind me. And this will be my bed for now. I'm just gonna sleep until yes, yeah, sleep for a solid eight hours. You need you need good rest to rescue the Commonwealth from the bad guys. Um, the game's crashed. Oh no, there we go. <laughs> I thought the game had crashed. I had a heart attack there for a second. I feel well rested. Yay. Okay, let's go see if the... Ah, oh, very, very bright. Ah, 
Uh, let's go see if anything grew in the meantime. It does not look like it has. Balls. Uh, I need to go find some food. I wonder if Trash Can Carla's here. I wonder if she has any food. Or does she only show up later in the game? Maybe she only shows up later. Um, I genuinely don't know what to do. Because <laughs> I, I, I want to get this done and dusted with so that I can just... I, oh god. I need I need to explore more. Let's see if there's any just food lying around. What's that? Is that I think that's just... That was cram, which is this game's equivalent of spam. Not spam as in like the emails you get, spam as in like... Why the fuck is there a fragmentation grenade in... What the fuck? What kind of people just leave a fragmentation grenade in a fucking trash can at the side of the road? I found some wild mute fruit, so I think I can plant that somewhere along the line. Some what more wild mute fruit. I, I think I can plant that. I'm not actually quite sure. If not, I'll just make a dirty wasteland or somewhere time down the road. Oh, we've got some enemies. Uh, I'm going to crouch and then... That helped me no way, shape or form. And then there's a rad stag there. No, there's literally just this wild mongrel. Oh, come on, man. Um, he's down, yeah. I've literally got four bullets left. I really need to find ammunition. Because <laughs> I've literally got four bullets in this, no bullets in this, and then I've got a baton. I, I really need to find ammunition. I should really get to... Uh, what's the name of the closest shop? It's just a little diner that some woman transformed into a shop. But, um, yeah, I should really get to that so I can buy some stuff. Uh, there's a melon in here. Oh, nice one. Nice one, nice one, nice one. Uh, what's in this trash can? If there's, an... there's just drugs and a shot glass in here. What kind of a fucking place is Sanctuary? I thought it was supposed to be nice. Um, oh, I just got a thing for wild meat fruit. Yay. I hope you can plant wild meat fruit. I cannot remember if you can plant wild meat fruit. I know you can plant normal meat fruit. Um, what's this? Oh, yeah, I know this thing. There's a... Ooh, a snub nose 44 fist, so that's actually quite nice. And a couple of cans and milk bottles and bobby pins and drugs. And then some rat away. And oh, just more drugs. Uh, what's here? What the fuck? Okay, um, vacuum sealed. Oh, follow this pipe down. <laughs> follow this pipe down, shut off this machine, and then I can open that lid. Oh, Jesus Christ, that's loud. Uh, right, yeah, no. <gasps> you bastard, you fucking touch dog me, I swear to God, you. I will end your life. I've literally got two bullets left, but still I will end your life. Uh, I'll take your... Oh, I'll put that dog collar in dog meat. Uh, open you up, and... Oh, to the bed. I've got a load of bottle caps. Uh, there's a raider there that I don't stand a chance in hitting. Ow! <laughs> That did very little damage to me, it's too far away. Um, oh fuck, I missed that. Yeah, I've got no bullets left in this, I need to switch over to the snub nose that I just found. Uh, or the minigun. Uh, no, the snub nose, I've got some bullets for that. Uh, uh, okay, I can hit him. Yeah, just one shot there should kill him. Uh, just one shot for her, and just one shot for her. That's him down, that is her down. And then the last person I'll just I'll just finish off myself. There we go. Nicely done. And I've no bullets for that now either. Uh, shotgun shells and a stim pack. I'm gonna rob the double barrel shotgun. It's just simply because I need something that uh, uh I I need something that will I can shoot with. Right, so I'm after finding a melon. Uh, about finding a melon and some wild mute fruits, I'm gonna head back to Sanctuary and I should be able to plant all of that stuff and that should uh, allow me to pass this mission. I'm gonna leave that rad stag because no, don't don't attack the rad stag. Don't bother. Like the only reason they'd attack you if you like cornered them. Dog meat, don't touch them. Dog meat, don't touch them. 
I, f I always feel sorry for the rad sags because they like never attack unless they're like feel threatened. Dog me, don't fucking touch him. Oh, for fuck's sake, dog me. I mean, I have been attacked by a rad stag before, but it's like quite rare. I think it's only happened like once or twice in my entire. Uh, let me check. In my 77 hours on PC and then like 100 plus hours on PS4. So it's, n it's not common whatsoever. Right, let's get into this mode and start planting some food that we found. Over to resources, over to food. Right, we're here, need to go over to melons. Plant the melon. And, oh fuck. I can't plant the wild mute fruit. Because it has to be just normal mute fruit. Um, I'm going to get someone to work on the... What are you doing? What what are you doing? I'm going to get you to work on the food as well. Because I don't think that... Oh! All the, everything's regrown. Everything's regrown. Everything that I planted a minute ago has regrown. So I'm able to double my food now. So if I go into the workbench and then, yeah, I can plant more gourds and melons and stuff. Nice one. And then over here, I can plant two more melons. Build it there. Right, yeah, I need to uh, get someone to work on the on the thing of a jabber again. Oh, wait, no, it's, it's done. All right, so I just need to talk to Sturgis, wherever he is. Go over in this direction. He must have run off. Great game. Great game. <laughs> 10 out of 10, IGN. Sturgis just teleport somewhere over here? Or is it, like, sent me onto a different mission entirely? Data. First step. Oh, no, that's something to do. No, talk to Sturgis. Where is he? He's over here somewhere. Oh, shit, we're being attacked. I have, like, nothing to use against, like, these bad guys. Why are we, why are we being attacked? Uh, I, I've got some bullets for this double barrel shotgun. But uh, other than that, no, we haven't got anything. Sturges! Sturges! No, I have to fucking kill whoever's attacking. Who is attacking? And why are you attacking? Who's actually attacking? Is it literally like... Is it just the fucking Radstag? I swear to God, if this is all about the Radstag, I'm going to kill one of you. Because I can't go over there because it's just like radioactive shit. Stay out of the water. I think it's literally just the Radstag. They're all firing at a rad stag. Mercy, get the fuck out of my power armor now. I hate it when NPCs get into your power armor. Because you can't get them out unless they're your companion. It's a stingwing. That was everything, I assume. No, they're still on high alert. Why, why is... You make no sense. He's done. Yeah, they got bored and wandered off. Fuck's sake. You better get the fuck out of my power armor. Right, now I can actually go talk to Sturges. Thank God. This place is starting to feel like home. Now that we can grow our own food, I think we can really make a go of this. Trouble is, the more we establish ourselves here, the more of a target we become. What we need is to get some defenses set up. Then maybe Preston will be able to relax a little bit. Um, yeah, sure, fuck it, why not? Ah, thanks. It'll make everyone feel more secure here. Literally just want to get this over and done with. Okay. Uh, start up this and then head over to defenses. No, not a guard post, I'll just set up a turret. Oh, I need circuitry to set up a turret, so I can't do that. Is that just the basic turret? I didn't realize you needed that much. Okay, just a, a guard post then, I suppose. Uh, I'm just going to build it. I'm just going to build two, like here. And uh, scrap you, and scrap you, and scrap you, and scrap you. Okay, yeah, so I'm just going to set up another guard post to stick. Actually, you know what? Fuck it, no. I'm going to build two of these big tall ones. Yeah, much nicer. Uh, scrap you, and another big tall one. Yeah, they, they look so much like more threatening. And there we go, you're down. Are they in line with each other? So line myself up. Uh, they're not too bad. I'll move this one a little bit forward. Now are they in line with each other? 
Yeah, they're pretty much in line with each other now. Uh, I need to get people on these now. Preston, where are you? And seeing as you're in a fucking power armor, I might as well get Marcy Long to do it as well. Oh, is that Marcy? Yeah. Where did you leave my power armor, Marcy? Marcy, where did you leave my power armor? Oh no, you're assigned to food, so I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get what? What's his name again? I actually cannot remember Mr. Handy's name. Um, Codsworth. There we go. Codsworth is uh, going to be assigned to this. Yep, that's resources now assigned, and I'm going to assign someone else. I want to assign Preston to it, wherever the fuck he is. Because there's no point only having one guard post. Oh wait, no. Uh, I think I think when you assign someone to a guard post, they actually like are assigned to a couple of guard posts and they walk around. So I'm going to check uh, if both of these are, are... No, you're not assigned. Okay, yeah, I do need to find Preston somewhere. Or just screw it, I'm just going to talk to hey, Sturgis. Sturgis. That'll help make everyone feel a little more secure. Thanks. It's been a long road. But yeah, I think this is it. Home. Feels good. I no butter whatsoever. Out. Well, I appreciate it. Of course, you know you're welcome anytime. My door's always open to you. Windows too. Some of the walls actually come to think of it. I guess I better get back to it. Take care now. Will do. Okay. It's time to head off on our adventure. Actually, do I have? Yeah, I've got two level up. Damn. Um. Okay, that's look, music is loud. I'm gonna have to trim that down a little bit. Uh, what am I gonna go for? I can't go for another. I'll go for another another unit in gunslinger, which gives me more damage in pistols. Because I'm gonna be using pistols quite a bit. But uh, what else am I gonna do? Armor? No. I think I'll go gun nut for the first one. Oh, actually, that's actually a good idea. Why don't I build uh, or craft or whatever some more? Not some more ammo, some um, uh, improvements for, for my gun and my armors and stuff. So, craft. Uh, I go down to my bolt action sniper rifle. And what kind of. Oh, I can make a hardened receiver, which does a whole lot more damage. It does 10 more damage per shot. Oh, I can actually change what kind of ammo it takes. It actually does less damage with that. And that does the most amount of damage, which is 0.5. Except for damage, changes ammo type to 0.5 caliber, improved rate of fire. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for hardened receiver because that is the best I can go for right now. And uh, what else can I do? A long barrel. Can I make a sniper barrel? And uh, no, I can't make a sniper barrel. Can I make a like a marksman stock? Like a like a really nice. Uh, if exceptional sighted accuracy, exceptional recoil, and aim with. Scopes, improved bash. So that's what I would go for if I had adhesive. This is why you pick up every single piece of adhesive you can in this game. It's so important for absolutely everything. Uh, can I go like a long range scope? Long recon scope. But that, I think that tags people on your maps as well. Uh, and no muzzle so far. I could put a suppressor. What the fuck kind of suppressor is that? Yeah, so that would be a more stealthy thing, which I will be going for. I wonder if I can put a suppressor on my pistol. I actually might stick with my with the snub nose, because that actually... I really like that. I can put an advanced receiver on it, but I can't because I don't... Wow, why do you need crystal for an advanced receiver on a snub nose rifle? Or a snub nose pistol? Uh, can I literally... I literally can't do anything to most of these guns. No, I can't, I can't do anything. Okay. Right, so... We're going to move on out of here. We're going to head into the Commonwealth and explore. And I'm now realizing that I only have my shotgun. So, yeah, I'm going to have to stealth this up until I actually can get some ammo for my sniper. Yeah, so we're going to head towards Diamond City, the jewel of the Commonwealth. I wonder if there's any ammo in this. There's drugs. There's fucking drugs everywhere in this game. It's ridiculous. It's like, well, it's like inner city Dublin. Oh, there's some gourd here. Thanks, Dogmeat. Dogmeat just opened a door and brought my attention to some gourd. Um, is there anything else in here? 
Because he must have opened the door for a reason. He must have found something. Uh, there's a red bandana, welding goggles, and a bobby pin. Oh, and a safe. I can't unlock it though. What's here? Some drugs. Seriously, exactly like Kinder City Dublin. And actually, what do these uh, like welding goggles and stuff do? Uh, right, so the eyeglasses give me plus one perception. The red bandana doesn't do anything. Uh, the sack hood doesn't do anything. Welding goggles, plus one perception. I'm going to go with the welding goggles and I'm going to put on the bandana. Uh, let's see what I look like now. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> I look like an absolute psychopath. Which, this is what I'm going for, yeah. Like, let's be honest, my wife's after being killed. I've been asleep for 200 years. My son's been kidnapped. This guy is going to be a fucking psychopath. The only reason why he's cool, calm, and collected in combat and is able to, like, pick people off from the distance is because he's got a military background. Oh, and the, uh, the shop that I was talking about earlier is actually after peering on my map. Oh, Trash Can Carla's here. She might have some ammunition for my, uh, for my sniper. Hopefully. If not, she should have ammunition. Huh? Who the fuck are you? Hold on, I want to talk to you first. Who are you? Excuse me, uh, sir. Would you happen to know the way to Bunker Hill? Um, you're from the Institute. Why do you need to go Why there? Why do you need to go there? I can't divulge my reasons, but I need to get there. Okay, he's just walking away from me. Uh, Dude. <clears throat> Excuse me, uh, sir. Yeah. Would you happen to know... Um... Just give me some caps. I don't, but give me your caps anyway. Wait, fuck you. He just keeps walking away from me. Um... Okay, I'm going to talk to Trash Hunt Carla, so. So what's your story? Looking to trade? Rob me? Or just ask directions to Diamond City? Um... I'm just going to Let's buy stuff off her. I have a little bit of everything. Yeah, so I need... I need 308s. She's got some 308s. Um... Right, so I'm going to go over to my weapons. I've got two 10mm pistols. I'm going to sell both of them to her. Uh... I'm also going to sell the fragmentation grenades, because grenades aren't really my guy's style. Same with the Molotovs. Uh, the Snub Nose pistol takes 44 ammo, so I'm going to buy some 308s on the 44. That's that's what I'm going to buy. Uh, right, so if I got 308s, that is a lot of caps. I do not have that many caps. I might if I sell some of the drugs that I have. Oh, and some of the... the yeah, I'm going to sell this sack hood and the casual outfit. Not the dog collar, I'm going to give that to Doug because he's a good boy. Uh, I'm going to sell the eyeglasses and the drifter outfit as well. Uh, okay, yeah, I can sell... I'm going to sell some... Yeah, I'm going to sell basically all the drugs that I have. Jet, Medex, I don't really use Medex. Mentats can go away as well. Uh, Psycho can go away. Rad X I'm keeping, Rad Away I'm keeping, Stim Packs I'm keeping. What miscellaneous things do I have? Nothing really. My junk. I'll give you that as well if you want it. Uh, 0.3. Oh, I can sell some of my ammo. I've got a bunch of 5 mils that I'm probably not going to be using anytime soon. Uh, I've got a bunch of fusion cells as well. You know what? I'm going to sell all my shotgun shells and my fusion cells and my 5 mil and my... 0.38s. Oh wow, that f th those five mil like were cost a lot of money, so I'm gonna I'm gonna get them back. And your your where are we? Your ammo. Where is it? Here. So I bought all the three oh eights I can. That's them there. Uh, what did my other gun take? The what did the snub nose take? 0.44. She doesn't have any of that, unfortunately, but. Uh, the 308 is still quite nice. I'm going to sell her my double barrel shotgun as well. Uh, no, I'm going to keep the minigun for now. I might sell that to someone else down the line. Uh, but I think that's all I'm going to need from you right now. Except that trade. Okay, now switch over to you and reload it. And there we go. We've actually got ammo for this thing now. 
Uh, right, so this is after showing up. These might actually might have some uh, .44 ammo. We had a deal, Trudy. Hand over the goods. You owe us. Okay. I ain't giving you poison shilling chem pushers anything. I'm after pressing space by accident. My boy. He bought the And... Pop. Okay. Yeah, this is definitely the build that I should have gone for in my Skyrim series. A stealth archer sniper thing. Uh, ooh, metal right arm. I'm taking that. Uh, yeah, Drumlin Diner. This is what I was going for. Uh, leather left leg. Somehow it's better than what I have on. Uh, I'm going to equip that. Metal right arm, which just does everything better. Uh, I can... Yeah, I'm going to sell some of this to her. Hey. Hi. <laughs> I can't wait to see the crows feeding on that scumbag. Here, this is for you. Now. If you ever need to trade, my shop's open. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna trade with you. Sure. Let's take a look. All salvage, but nothing's junk. Well, there's literally a category called junk, so some of it's junk. Uh you've got you don't have any point four fives either. I'm gonna buy your three oh eights though. I've got some Yeah, I can sell that. I can sell both of them. Anything else that I have double of? Uh no, no, no. What else do you have? Do you have... Oh, you have a switchblade. I wouldn't mind a switchblade instead of my baton. I might buy that. Yeah, I'm going to buy a shiv instead of my baton. Uh, so I go over here and... S oh my god, I'm just after accidentally selling like my fucking pistol to her. Wait, did I? No, that's a peril. Weapons. Yeah. Do not sell the snub nose. That is, that is mine. Uh, yeah, so now I've got a switchblade. Why is... Oh, that's what I have equipped. I thought I was I was buying that offer. No. Uh, right, so that is everything. I don't really want to lose all that money, so I'm going to sell you some of my 5 mil ammo. Just so that I can clear you out. So 500 should do. Yeah, sell you 500 ammo. That gives me 300 extra caps. And leaves you basically bankrupt. See ya! Right, so now I have even more ammo for this. Yay! Right, now start heading towards uh, Diamond City. That building over there, that thing there, when you get close to it, it absolutely kills your frame rate. I think it does it on, on the console version as well, but like, it, it, like, I'm running at a smooth, like, 60 on, on this, but, like, when you get up to that, it jumps down to, like, 25. It's ridiculous. And I don't know why, because it's just, it's just a big building. Oh, there's a, a little crate up here on, on just along the side of the road. Oh, oh well, there's a skeleton next to it. What the fuck just happened? Uh, yeah, there's two skeletons here as well, and some radex and a mop. I'm going to take the mop, because I think that gives you wood and cloth in the in scrapbook. Oh, and... Oh, and I'm after picking up Military Frequency AF95. Let's give that a a bit of a listen over to the radio and Military Frequency. Automated message repeating. This is Scribe Halen of Reconnaissance Squad Gladius to any unit in transmission range. Authorization ARCS, Pharaoh 95. Our unit has sustained casualties and we're running low on supplies. We're requesting support or evac from our position at Cambridge Police Station. Yeah, so that has started up the quest where you can meet the Brotherhood for the first time. Uh, I, I don't know who this character is going to side with. I might, like, once we meet all the, the factions, I might put that in a in a card for a poll above my head. Um. Yeah, I might, I might leave, I've got to leave that up to you guys, so I'm going to put a card in one of the episodes, not this one, because we haven't met all the the factions yet, so, yeah, I'm going to leave that decision up to you. Audience participation, that's how you get people invested. I, th I actually think Cambridge Police Station is, like, right here. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have any short range... Okay, yeah, so the firefight is already happening at Cambridge. Oh, shit, the bed! Uh, no, I need to switch over to my minigun, because that's my own... Oh, my God. Let's start firing. Jesus Christ. Yeah, 
Yeah, I need to head over here to get fire support from the Brotherhood. Like, I need to do that quickly. <laughs> um, right, so there should be Pharaoh Ghouls just attacking these guys over here. Yes, there are. It's quite the firefight happening over here. Okay. Oh, I'm after leveling up, thank god. Uh, right, take the... Oh god. Uh, right, the set spraying. Spraying, spraying. I'm like Bastion! No, I'm not. Oh god. Get out the gun! Get out your gun! Why, why aren't you getting out your fucking gun? Okay, you. Dead. You. Uh, you. Dead. Okay, get behind some cover. Uh, up here, up here. Get a vantage point, get a vantage point. Don't get stuck! Oh my god! No! Get up! Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Uh, right, you dead. Uh, right, who's next, who's next, who's next? Uh, right, so there's a guy here. You're dead already. Don't need to waste ammo on you. Okay, speak to Paladin and dance. Yo. Hey, we appreciate the assistance, civilian. But what's your business here? Um, I prefer to keep the business to yourself. Yeah, stay, 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 like, just I inside me. I keep my business to myself. Yeah, you look kind, like kind of a rogue. Discuss, I suggest you leave our compound immediately. Yo, I'm after helping you. Paladin dance. Have you decided to cooperate and tell me what brought you here? Fine. I'm just, just trying I'm to just survive. Trying to survive out here, like everyone else. The way you charged in and engaged those ferals, I find that a bit difficult to believe. There's still Are some ghouls over there attacking, by the way. Uh, um, I'm from a vault. Yeah, just I'm tell them I'm from a vault. From You're a vault dweller? Most people wouldn't admit to such a thing. I appreciate your honesty. If I appear suspicious, it's because our mission here has been difficult. Since the moment we arrived in the Commonwealth, we've been constantly under fire. If you want to continue pitching in, we could use an extra gun on our side. Yeah, sure, I'll just keep helping. I'll continue to help, but you owe me an explanation first. Very well. I'm Paladin Dance, Brotherhood of Steel. Over there is Scribe Halen and Knight Reese. We're on recon duty, but I'm down a man and our supplies are running low. The fuck I've just happened? I've sent a distress call to my superiors, but the signal's too weak to reach them. Sir. If I may. Proceed, Halen. I've modified the radio tower on the roof of the police station, but I'm afraid it just isn't enough. What we need is something that will boost the signal. Our target is ArcJet Systems, and it contains the technology we need, the deep range transmitter. We infiltrate the facility, secure the transmitter, and bring it back here. So what do you say? You willing to lend the Brotherhood of Steel a hand? Yeah, sure, let's go. Waste. Let's get moving. Outstanding. Okay, let's just like head in here. Ooh, Stimpax. Yay, Stimpax. Take Reese inside and find his wounds. Yes, sir. Yeah, can you open the door? I want to go in. Oh wait, no. These guys usually have like military grade duct tape. That's great. Bottle caps. Bottle caps. Uh, no useless. Small rat teeth. No flip lighter. Well, I'm gonna take that. It's got stuff. Pack of cigarettes. Just like yeah, loot everything. Uh, military grade duct tape. Fucking great. Plastic spoon. Jesus Christ, he's done a fairly good job wiping these guys out. Uh, he's got a fuse, he's got a wooden block, a plastic spoon, bottle caps and 10 mil rounds, I can sell them. 0.38s and a kickball, that's rubber, which is nice. Uh, yeah, let's... After I'm done... Oh, Wonder Glue, beautiful. Uh, some shotgun shells and some 0.38s, that's... That's not what my pistol is, is it? Uh, no, my pistol is 0.44s. Okay, I think I've looted most of them. Um, sh should I head in here or should I continue? You know what? I'm gonna end the episode there. I'm not even going to do either for this episode. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna go into Cambridge Police Station in the next episode, but uh, just for now, I'm gonna leave you on a bit of a cliffhanger. Uh, thank you all very much for watching and goodbye.